Hi, in this tutorial, we will go through all the elements of the item display area. The item display area is the area where the details of the build items appear. The fields displayed are the serial number, the item's name, the quantity, the basic price, promotions and discounts if any, the sale price which is the basic price after the promotion and discounts have been applied on that item and lastly the gross price which is the quantity into sale price. Now if we scan an item it appears in the item display area. Under each item selected we find some buttons. The remove button removes the selected item from the list. The return toggle button marks the item for return. The edit quantity button allows us to edit the quantity of the item. The edit price button allows the user to edit the basic price. Please remember this button is enabled in a user role specific manner. This discount button allows a user to apply predefined discounts to the selected item. Now if we look below the item display area, we see certain dynamic fields. These are the barcode of the selected item, the group that item belongs to, the bill discounts and item promotions if any, item comments if any related to the current item, the retail sales price or the RSP of the selected item, the sales person assigned to this item and the apportioned amount that is the amount in which the bill level discount is proportionately distributed among the items in the bill. Now we would see the payment details area. This small payment details box shows the sale quantity that is the total number of items sold in the bill. This is the net payable amount for the customer. The returned quantity is the number of items returned through the bill. The amount of the returned items are also shown. Now, when we click the list button, the bill details pop-up opens. The gross amount is the sale price of the total number of items. Bill discount is the discount given on the entire bill. Loyalty discount is the discount given to a particular customer depending on the loyalty benefit. Taxes extra are applicable after the promotional discounts like the local VAT. Net sale is the amount after all applicable discounts and taxes. Round off shows the amount needed to round off the net sale and make the net payable a round figure. Net payable is the amount to be paid by the customer. And the total savings is the amount a customer saves on the bill due to applicable discounts and promotions. So, we've seen all the elements of the item display area. To get the latest news and more information on Guinnesses, subscribe to our channel. Thank you.